Yo, what's going on, YouTube? Card up on defense here, back in the video today. In this video, we'll be talking to you guys about if ISO lockdown builds are secretly one of the best locks in the game. Now, there's quite a few people out there who do have ISO locks, but for the meta community, I don't think there's too many of them. But before getting that new channel, that's up on the road to that subscribe, should like comment as well. And yeah, that's great in the video. So, small forward six, seven, basically like every other lock in this game. Uh, only difference between this lock and most other ones, you're going to be able to dribble and isolate and make your own kind of plays, especially with the 86 ball hand you're going to have. You can go lower, which I'll show later on, but for now, this is what we're going to go with. So I'm going to go 6-7, seven, 7-4 seven, wingspan, which is max. And then the way you can mess with it, you can go max if you want to, because I'm not going to go all the way up on the strength, but I will be able to get that extra player build, so I have a bigger player model, which can help defensively. Now, speed, I decided to go 85. That's why I went down to 237, just to get the 85 speed. Which does help quite a bit. 84 strength, 73 excel to get silver fast feet. Now, this isn't a pure lock by any means, but it's definitely a lockdown defender. It's got some pretty solid defense overall, and you're going to be able to play make as well, which is a big thing. And then also 74 vertical to get chased down on silver. And later on, I will upgrade, upgrade the block to a 79, which you will see just to get that bronze pogo stick. Now, the rebounding is not going to be crazy in this build compared to other ones. I will come back to it and show you, but it's definitely not high just because the playmaking costs quite a bit. So you're going to have to sacrifice something. I decided to do rebounding. And if you want to get rebounding, you could try to get it a different way. But also, big thing for this build, please go 80 speed with ball. Now, I know a lot of people used to have a uh, 75 speed with ball. You don't want to do that anymore because Devin Booker dribble styles in the game and you need an 80. So make sure you do that. It's going to help you tremendously in the ISO situations. Uh, as far as the layup, I decided to go. You can see 68 gives you quite a few. And then 70 gives you a really good mix of uh, driving layup badges there. That also can help with your dunk a little bit. Now, the finishing isn't crazy in the build. If you want more finishing, you'd have to probably go less shooting, like lower the mid range. But again, I'd say having that better jump shot is more important than that high finishing. Just That's just me personally, though. Yeah. But you can see you got 88 perimeter to get that gold 94 feet badge, gold workhorse. And here's the rebound I'm showing you guys. You can definitely get it up if you lower the ball handle to 81. Uh, it's not going to be anything too crazy, but it's something. I would recommend just go to 60 old board just to get bronze rebound chaser. And then keep the 86 ball handle, which I will get right here. Um, now, obviously, if you could get anywhere around an 85 steady dunk in this build by doing any sort of tweaking, that would be ideal. But I really don't think there's a way for you to get it. But overall, it's a very solid build. You're going to be able to play pretty good defense. You're going to be a great shooter because you got the high mid range, which means better shooting badges, better shots. And of course, 86 ball handle is going to help out your team when they need a bucket at the end of a shot clock or anything like that. This is a great park build just because being able to have that ball handle is really nice for a lockdown build probably not a stage build because it's not super meta like but it is definitely pretty solid and the finishing is even easier in park because it's very easy to get open dunks and layups in park so you would be perfectly fine in fives a little bit harder so you have to be a little bit more creative with how you score in the paint but you can definitely make it work really this is kind of the uh, way i would start out with the build is something like this and kind of tweak it how you want uh, obviously if you do want higher perimeter and steel you can try to get it but again you're going to have to lower probably the mid range which kind of takes away from the whole point of having a really nice jump shot on a lock so i probably wouldn't recommend that but for the most part it's a pretty solid build there's really not too much you can change uh, but as long as you have the 86 ball handle you get kemba escape and all the dribble sticks you're really going to need and the Devin booker dribble style is just going to be glitchy for you being able to do that push cross and being able to burst with the same hand is really solid you get silver speed booster which isn't too bad at all and you get some solid playmaking badges so definitely a very solid build i think these are definitely worth making if you want to try it and make it your own way because you don't have to copy mine exactly but anything like it can be pretty solid we hope you guys did enjoy we should like come subscribe hope to see you in the next one thanks for watching